Due to the huge distances and large time constraints, traditional railways are no longer adequate, so countries are forced to build faster and faster high-speed railways. High-speed rail was first introduced in Japan, with the first Shinkansen train running in 1964, and since then there has been a great competition between countries to build the fastest trains. The current fastest train is Japan's low-series high-speed railway, which was able to reach 603 km per hour, but we still have a long way to go before we can see it in action. In today's video, we are going to look at the fastest operational trains in the world, in the year of 2023. Before we continue, make sure to like this video, and subscribe to Indigo Future. And let us know in the comments below, which one you like the most after you watch this video. Number 10. Hexi Hao, CRH2C. Hexi Hao, CRH2C, is a high-speed train model in China, introduced in 2007, and its technology is based on a Japanese high-speed train type. It belongs to the CRH2 train type. The CRH2C is an improved version of the CRH2A, manufactured by Kawasaki Heavy Industries for a 2005 tender by the Chinese Ministry of Transport. It is operated on China's high-speed railway lines, and was first put into service on the Zhengzhou Shen high-speed railway in 2010. This is the fastest type of the CRH2 train family, its operating speed is 300 km per hour, but it is designed for a speed of 350 km per hour. In 2008, it achieved record speed as it was able to go over 370 km per hour on the Beijing Tianjin High Speed Rail Line. Number 9. KTX-1 and KTX Sanjin. Korea Train Express, also known as KTX, is South Korea's high speed rail network, operated by Korea, the national railway operator of South Korea. The KTX service was first launched in 2004 and is based on two train types, KTX-1 and KTX Sanjin. KTX-1 is based on French TGV technology and was created by Alstom and Hyundai Rotom. Created by Hyundai Rotom, the KTX Sanjin is an improved version of the KTX-1 and has been in service since 2010. The new type enables more efficient and energy-saving transport, and has a faster, renewed and more modern design. The operating speed of the KTX-1 is 305 km per hour, but it is designed for a speed of 330 km per hour, while the KTX Sanchin has the same operating speed as the KTX-1. In 2013, a KTX-1 set a speed record when it went over 421 km per hour, making South Korea the world's fourth country after Japan. Number 8. Talgo 350. Nicknamed Pato in Spain, because its nose resembles a beak at the duck, the Talgo 350 is a high-speed train in Spain and Saudi Arabia, manufactured by Talgo, based on Bombardier transportation technology. The train is equipped with the latest technologies in a push-pull configuration, and has two ends and can be equipped with up to 12 passenger coaches. Talgo guarantees a completely enjoyable travel experience, the Talgo 350 provides a stable, quiet and smooth ride. AV is mainly used within Spain and serves various high-traffic rail lines, such as the Madrid-Barcelona high-speed rail line. In October 2018, Talgo provides a high-speed rail fleet for the Mecca Medina high-speed railway line in Saudi Arabia, named Haramain high-speed railway. The trains on the Haramain HSR required significant development, as the railway runs through the desert, the trains have to deal with dust and sand. Talgo 350 trains can reach speeds of up to 350 km per hour, but are only operated at 300 km per hour due to the limitations of the railway infrastructure in Spain and Saudi Arabia. Number 7. Avelia Euro Duplex The Avelia Euro Duplex, more commonly known as just the Euro Duplex, is a high-speed double-decker train manufactured by Alstom that operates in France and Morocco. An improved version of TVG Duplex Dassi, thus including new functions and providing a better travel experience. The Avelia Euro Duplex, a double-decker railway, can accommodate 40 more passengers than a single-decker train of the same length. Passengers feel less vibration and the journey is quieter, the trains provide passengers with Wi-Fi internet. It entered commercial use in 2017. It also crosses borders, for example from France to Switzerland, Spain, Luxembourg, and Germany, where the trains travel at 320 km per hour. Another version of the Euro Duplex operates in Morocco, where it was inaugurated in 2018 and is the first high-speed railway on the African continent. 
The trains are designed for a speed of 350 km per hour, but they only operate at 320 km per hour. In April 2007, a modified tuned TGV mail train set a speed record for conventional trains when it exceeded 570 km per hour, the fastest speed achieved by a conventional wheeled train to date. Number 6. Avilia AVG 575 Italo is Europe's first private high-speed rail operator, which started operating in Italy in 2012. Based on the latest technologies, the TGV 575, designed according to the Alia high-speed trains, the train has a distributed drive system under the entire train, the traditional locomotive technology is placed. This innovative concept allows for more space and thus the train can accommodate more passengers. The articulated train set with split power and Jacob's bogies eliminates most of the vibration and noise from onboard movement and absorbs movement between cars. The Avilia Average 757 offers a wide range of long-term financial benefits, such as 15 to 30 percent less energy consumption thanks to its aerodynamic design. The trains ensure a comfortable journey and are divided into four classes, each of which is characterized by free Wi-Fi, front television and plenty of space for all passengers. The maximum speed of the trains is 360 km per hour, but they can only travel at 300 km per hour. Number 5. Shinkansen N700S Series Japan's high-speed rail network, the Shinkansen, is one of the fastest rail networks in the world. In July 2020, Japan announced its latest record, the record-breaking N700S bullet train, entered service on the Tokyo Shinkansen line, running between Tokyo and Osaka. It is the sixth-generation model of the N700 series, with lifeline new features such as improved automatic control and braking system and lithium-ion battery self-driving system. This allows the train to run autonomously in the short term by switching to a backup battery system in case of power outages or regular earthquakes in the archipelago. The train is equipped with various anti-vibration devices to ensure smooth travel. The train is designed for 360 km per hour but it can only run at 285 km per hour on the Tokyo Shinkansen line and 300 km per hour on the Sanyo Shinkansen line. Announced in 2022, the Dallas-Houston Railway project, expected to be completed by 2030, Texas Central Railway plans to operate N700 series trains, providing adequate rail transportation for Texas. Number 4. Shinkansen H5, E5 and E6 series. The Tohoku Shinkansen line, operated by East Japan Railway Company, is Japan's longest high-speed rail line and home to Japan's bullet train service, and Japan's fastest bullet train service called the Hayabusa, which began operations in 2011. Three types of trains of the same technical characteristics run on this route. The E5 and H5 series have the same design, only the color of the strip on the sides is different for the two types, the color of the trains are both lavender. And the third version is the E6 series, which is red in color and mainly operates a small extension cord called Actica. The trains are manufactured by both Hitachi and Kawasaki, and the development is based on the express trains of the past. The 15-meter-long nose of the trains helps to create a boom effect when the trains enter the tunnel at high speed. The trains offer three travel classes, the interiors are made of genuine leather seats with wool carpets and metallic elements. Although the trains could be operated at up to 360 km per hour, their permitted travel speed is only 320 km per hour. Number 3. Zephyro V300 The Bombardier Zephyro V300, a high-speed train for the Italian national railway company Trenitalia, first entered service in June 2015. It is the first high-speed train in the world to obtain the certificate. The designers put special emphasis on environmental protection, taking into account the emission of carbon dioxide, which can be limited to only 28 grams. This train also provides noise and vibration reduction for its passengers and is 85% recyclable. The length of the assemblies is possible in two versions, the shorter version is 202 meters long, while the longer version can be up to 402 meters long. The interior is divided into four classes, inside it combines elegance, maximum travel conditions, wide spaces, ergonomic seats and many other things that are necessary for a proper trip. The train is equipped with a 16-gear distributed traction system and can reach speeds of up to 360 km per hour. 
However, it is only operated at a speed of 300 km per hour on the Italian high-speed rail network due to the maximum permitted speed, but in the following years the train will also be available in Spain, so we can even see it in higher speed operation. Number 2. Siemens Villaro Based on the German Intercity Express 3 technology, the Valero family was developed and implemented by Siemens for the global market. Configured according to reliable international requirements, the high-performance Villaro family can be operated in four climate zones, from Spain to Italy or China. Spanien Rinth is its first operator, the 103 Avid class, known as the Villaro E, has been nominated. It covers the distance of 625 km between Barcelona and Madrid in less than two and a half hours, and Rinth has maximized the maximum speed allowed to 310 km. Resisting both fire and water, the Velaro 320, operated by Eurostar, has been specially designed to meet the exacting standards of cable car regulations. However, Eurostar operates these trains at 320 km per hour. The Velaro DS is the fourth generation of high-speed trains developed by Siemens and developed for Deutsche Bahn. Trains can be operated at speeds of up to 320 km per hour on Germany's high-speed railway tracks but the train is also operated to France on international routes. The Turkish Velaro, a derivative of the Velaro high-speed train developed for the Turkish state railways. Its power is 8,000 kW, and its maximum permitted speed is 300 km per hour. The Russian Velaro, also known as the Samson, is a version of the Velaro developed for Russia, designed to cope with the country's harsh weather conditions. The trains run at only 250 km per hour which means that the 650 km Moscow to St. Petersburg section can be covered in three and a half hours. The Siemens Valero is designed for a maximum speed of 360 km per hour, but operators only operate it at a maximum speed of 320 km per hour, making it one of the fastest trains in the world. Number 1. Fuxing Hao, CR400 AF and BF. In June 2017, Fuxing Hao launched China's newest standardized electric train, which claims to be one of the best in the world. After entering service on the Beijing-Shanghai railway line, it became the fastest operating railway line in the world. This train is a new era of high-speed rail system compared to the previous Hexi trains where most of the components and technology are imported from overseas. The trains are elegant and smooth, they have two types, the blue and red CR400AF and the gold CR400BF. The trains were designed to reduce energy consumption and be environmentally friendly, which is reflected in the appearance and construction of the trains. The interiors are comfortable and elegant, and passengers are provided with free Wi-Fi and phone charging services. Fuxing Hao is currently the fastest wheeled train in the world, with a maximum speed of 400 km per hour, but it only operates at 350 km per hour. In a country as large as China, speed is a very important factor in the distance between cities and how it is implemented, which has been the strength of China's high-speed rail industry in recent decades. 